politics. A new movement, Rescue Nigeria Project, has resolved to form a pressure group that would wrestle Nigeria from what it terms a poor leadership crisis. Forces behind this new movement are key players in the political space. The group hopes to unite working people and the masses beyond ethnicity and religion while attaining a new Nigerian renaissance. Happy Dalla World Report. After that, we'll have business news with Toli Lokwe. The national question has been a thorny in Nigeria, being a multi-ethnic country, and has manifested through ethnic, religious, and regional relationships, rivalries and claims, and the common Nigerian state. It has made instituting good governance in Nigeria a struggle. This political gathering is worried about what it sees as an almost total absence of good governance, especially at local, grassroots level, which has fueled the flame of ethnic, regional, and religious politics. Lack of institutional capacity to deliver pro-people's policies and get these to positively impact on the quality of life of the downtrodden has given room for agitations for breakup, religious and regional bigotry, as well as a lack of confidence in the state to cater for the citizens. Go back a couple of generations, Spain is much, much poorer than those countries. So what shall we do to change the mindset of the politician to be production focused rather than revenue focused? Because revenues are killing us. We're all struggling to gain more revenues. How can we do what can we manipulate? Is it a petroleum act or bill or whatever it is? Is it that? Is that? And yet we're just rushing for what will make us poor. So let us see if political parties can develop a mindset that can get us away from where we are. Somehow, our focus has shifted from adding value to the resources that we have to extracting it for peanuts. And I want to plead with every one of us to be conscious that this privilege will not last forever. Deliberations here will be developed in assess and delivery of good governance by local, state, and national governments on a regular basis. If you look at what we are doing, we want to see how we do things differently. There have been so much talk shows in Nigeria. There have been so much uh, activities being put in place in terms of effort, but none has really translated into working the talk. So we want to see this as a platform that for once we genuinely and sincerely bear our minds on the critical issues that are facing us in terms of insecurity, in terms of economy, and of course in infrastructure and most importantly, on the social dislodgement that we are faced with. What is worrisome is not only the fact that so many things are wrong, but the very fact that people do not seem to care that things are wrong. And the youths are watching. And they ask the question, where is our future? The plan is to broaden the base and promote the participation of working people in the political and economic processes of the country towards the realization of the socialist transformation of Nigeria. Ahead of the 2023 general election, this political pressure group hope to consolidate on its relationship with Nigerians in contestation of political power from the ruling class by any means necessary. Habib Alawal, TVC News, Abuja.